Hey everybody, it's York again from Portugal and Beyond. Coming to you from Paris, I want to give you a quick update on Portugal's uh, travel restrictions or where they stand. This is March 24th, uh, Thursday, and they just announced that mask mandates for indoor spaces is extended through April 18th. So, for example, we're in Paris right now and it's it's kind of nice. Uh, other than public transportation, we don't have to wear a mask anywhere, which is, which is nice. But in Portugal, so if you're going there for travel, at least through April 18th, not just on the airplane and on public transportation like buses and trams and, and the metro, uh, but when you're inside, you're also going to need to keep the mask on. So that's something, um, you know, make sure you pack a couple of extra masks if you're going to be there a long time. Um, so that way you always have one handy in case one of the straps breaks on one of the masks, something like that. So that's the first thing um, as companies or as companies, countries are removing restrictions. Portugal kind of has kept, they started reducing and now they've kind of kept this even plain. For right or wrong, it, it is what it is. Um, so just remember that. And then secondly, the passenger locator forms. It's another thing that more countries are removing as a form of entry. We flew into France, we did not need a, a locator form or an attestation form or whatever countries call it these days. We're able to get in. Portugal still requires that. In fact, the flight that we were boarding when it was arriving and unloading passengers, they had CEF, which is the security, uh, the immigration and customs, if you will, uh, for Portugal. They were checking all the passengers when they came off to make sure they had their QR code. So you had a number of people pulling out their phones, showing the QR code, or they had a printed document that showed the QR code, the locator form to get into Portugal. So Mass still going on inside, so make sure you got one, make sure you got a couple of extras uh, for your trip to Portugal. And then number two, you're gonna be asked for the passenger locator form. Uh, I don't believe you can actually check into your flight um, without it. So that's something that they're gonna ask for it when you land. Uh, so that's it, I uh, hope you're doing well. I hope you start traveling. I hope Portugal's a destination along with wherever else you may be going in the world. Let's start traveling again. Um, even though there's still bumps in the road, let's make it happen. So as always, thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Hey, thanks so much for watching the full video. If you get a chance and if you're interested in reading some crazy workplace stories, please check out my two books, Magnet of Badness, Volume 1 and Volume 2, both available on Amazon in ebook or soft cover. If you want to make fun of me, there's plenty of stories where you can do that. If you want to make yourself feel better about the job that you're in, It'll make you feel better too. But uh, crazy stuff that happened over 30 years, you won't believe it until you read it. So thank you so much for watching. And if you get a chance, pick up a copy of one of these on Amazon. Thank you so much.